They grow no food, raise no livestock, and live without rules or calendars. They are living a hunter-gatherer existence that is little changed from 10,000 years ago. They are living a hunter-gatherer existence that is little changed from 10,000 years ago. The Hodza of Northern Tanzania are one of the last hunter-gatherer people on Earth. They hunt by bow and arrow, they dig for roots by sharpened stick and they gather honey and fruit by hand. The Hodza also find different species of antelopes in the area such as Kudu. In this video the Hadzeb tribe men have already hunted two dictics and have just arrived home where the women will cook ugali and soup so stay tired to see how they cook the soup and how they eat. Women normally welcome them happily knowing that today is a day of good meal. The Hadzeb tribe treasure meat so much that nothing goes to waste as they eat everything including the guts.
They don't wash the meat and the guts but cook them mixed together in a pot to preserve the flavor and also don't add salt to the food.
Women sit around the fireplace telling stories as men sit on their own fireplace until the food is totally cooked and ready to serve. They rarely clean their pots and sulfurias as water is hard to find since it comes far away from the rivers and sometimes they borrow some little water from the Detoga tribes who are farmers and livestock keepers. As you can see the meat is not washed as it is full of blood and the guts are filled with chyme so the flavor of the meat remains intact. The broth is stirred using sticks as they don't use spoons until it is well cooked and ready to serve. Both men and women of the Hadzeb tribe smoke marijuana mixed with tobacco, a product they get from the Toga and Arab tribes. I know you are wondering where they get the money to buy the products, but we coming to shoot the tribe normally pays a lot of money for shooting permits and also government of Tanzania provides some basic needs like kitenges and maize floor for them. I'm 
One thing I noticed is that the Hadzeb tribe don't have a fixed schedule for eating main meals as they cook only once in a day. Once the food is ready women normally have their share as men are given their own and the meal is split equally between men and women. Women serve the hot food using bare hands as they don't use spoons and also the broth is drunk directly from the hot sufferers.
I know you are still watching this video because you love such kind of videos so kindly make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel so that you will get notified every time we post a new video like this. Ah. 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 Ah.